you know, when you have a population of adults who are seriously dumbed down, and an awful lot of those adults refusing, refusing to acknowledge that a whole lot is happening in this country that is very, very different. No, they just want to live their self-centered lives. When you have parents in that condition, they are a danger to their children. The vaccines, no. I am not going to do any research. I'm just going to call you an anti-vaxxer and think you're crazy. So I'm going to shoot up my kid with poisons. The GMOs. I'm just going to believe that all of this food is absolutely fine. They say that it's fine. Monsanto scientists say that genetically modified foods are safe. So I'm going to eat them. Psychiatric medications. My, my son's teacher said that he's really hyperactive. So I need to take him to a psychiatrist. Oh, and that psychiatrist that I took him to, well, he's ADHD. So I'm on my way to fill up a prescription. No, no, no. Are you kidding? Come on. This is a prescription from a doctor. This can't be dangerous. All right. You try to educate people about geoengineering. All of the aluminum, barium, and strontium, and all of, all of the ingredients that are falling down, sprayed by planes and drones and the, the, the spraying, so obvious, 24-7 now, you cannot. No one who is of sound mind could look at the sky and think, nothing's happening there. All right, so you have an awful lot of parents who just will not ever face reality. You try to educate them about the geoengineering, the chemtrails, all of these incredibly dangerous chemicals and heavy metals, biologicals, fungi, all of the stuff that they are spraying into our atmosphere that comes down to the ground. It's in the snow. And instead of doing any research, this father is sitting here with his son. And what are they making? They are making snow ice cream. You're in luck. You can use that fresh supply of snow to make your own ice cream. And this four-year-old boy is going to show you how and put his culinary skills to the test. Take it away. Okay, let's do that. We gathered snow from outside. We put it in a bowl. We have the special milk and we've got the vanilla. Let's mix it up, Dad, and eat it. Every person there is culpable. Both of those adults are culpable. Feeding that child poison. Toxic snow. This is the world that we are living in. I, all right, so you take a parent and they refuse to acknowledge reality. They just can't acknowledge it. They want to live in their Disneyland unreal life. Fine. But in that Disneyland unreal life, well, no one would deny that there's an awful lot of pollution, right? Pollution in the air. So how could a father collect that snow from outside, and make snow ice cream with his son. It's a wow world. 
something has manifested here and it is friggin nuts the link is below yeah enjoy enjoy your snow ice cream son it's toxic but hell the vaccines I shot you up with are toxic and no doubt in sixth or uh, not uh, sixth grade but could be fifth grade could be fourth grade you may be acting out and I'm going to put you on psychiatric medications. Yay! Oh, yes. Where is your phone? I have to locate your phone so you can stare at your phone. That will emit dangerous frequencies that go right into your skull, cross your blood-brain barrier, and isn't it great to be alive, son? I love you so much, but I've already warped your entire life. Set you on a trajectory where you will never, ever be able to live your potential.